All right, for those of you who are all virtual, <clears throat> this is the Unit 3A test on economic inequality. It'll be in similar format to the others. Uh, first one, despite the existence of five to six social classes in America, most Americans will call themselves middle class when asked. Why do you think this occurs? Explain your opinion using information that we discussed in the unit. So why would most Americans, even those who are either too wealthy or too poor to consider themselves middle class, why would they say that? Number two, there's a significant difference between income and wealth in America. Give an explanation for each and an example of each. So what is the difference between income and wealth? And then give some examples. Three, power is defined both in terms of money and influence in America. What examples do you have of each and how does power play a role in economic inequality? Power. Four, social mobility is the ability to move up or down in social class. In America, it is believed that one can become wealthy through hard work and opportunity. Why do you think so many Americans believe in this idea? Okay, we call that the American dream, if that helps you. All right, then your extra. In your opinion, is the quote-unquote American dream still applicable today in 2020, or I'll change to 2021? Why or why not? Okay, so it's an extra one. It's basically... Um, uh, the points will go wherever you need it if you missed anything, but um, is it still applicable uh, today? Why or why not? And give your opinion. Okay. All right. That's it. So uh, very short test. And uh, when we're done, uh, make sure you turn it in and I will start posting uh, the notes for 3B, which is racial and ethnic inequality, probably in the next day or so. Have a good, good uh, time doing the test and good luck.